I left the woods for as good a reason as I went there. Perhaps it seemed to me that I had lived several lives and could not spare any more time for wandering. The surface of the 15-minute city is smooth in all directions, and the infrastructure is well-maintained, making it easy for one to navigate. The city is designed to be accessible to all, with everything that one needs to live a comfortable life within a 15-minute radius. The city is bustling with activity, and one can find everything from grocery stores to parks, and even an infinity pool, all within a short distance of one's home. The infinity pool is an oasis in the midst of the city. It is a place of tranquility where one can escape from the hustle and bustle of everyday life. The water is cold and deep, and the sun reflects off its surface, creating a dazzling display of light. The infinity pool is a place of contemplation where one can reflect on the beauty of life and the world around them. As I sit by the side of the infinity pool and watch the water, I am reminded of the beauty and simplicity of life. I am reminded that the most important things in life are not material possessions, but rather the relationships we have with others and the connections we make with the world around us. The 15-minute city is a place where one can live a simple and meaningful life surrounded by all that is necessary, prescribed, and convenient. It is remarkable how easily and insensibly we fall into a particular rut and make an endless loop for ourselves. I had not lived here a week before my feet marked a path from my door to the infinity pool. And though it is five or six days since I waited in the waters, it is still quite chilling. It is true, I fear that others may have fallen into the deep end, and so I may help to warn them.